I'm Catherine, I'm 20 years old, but when I was 18, I was diagnosed with a congenital heart defect. I would get really bad heart palpitations where my heart would beat super fast. There's no real reason why it happened. It never happened when I was playing sports. It never happened when I was, you know, with my friends. It would just, I would just be standing there and it would start beating really fast. I, you know, would bring it up to people be like, what's this? What's going on? And you know, the response is, oh, you're fine. It's fine. We'll deal with it later. So it's hard to explain when you're that young and you just don't have the vocabulary or concept of what's going on to say, this is what's happening and it makes me scared or something. It, it doesn't, it didn't even cross my mind that I would have a heart problem. Michelle Mallet is a very dear friend. I found out and was quite alarmed as everybody was to hear that Michelle had had, uh, at the time, we, we called it a heart attack. My mom called me and told me about Michelle. She said, Michelle is in the hospital. She had a heart attack and she almost died. Because of her, I went in. And that is when we did learn that, that the diagnosis was much more significant and serious, which was a hole in between the two atrial chambers of her heart. Had we not discovered that, the result would have been heart failure. I think as a parent, the last thing you think when your child has a symptom is that it's a deformity of their a defect in their heart that was undetected for 18 years. Don't let people invalidate your feelings because you are the only person who knows something is wrong. If they don't believe it, do it yourself. Go to the doctor yourself because this isn't a matter of like being embarrassed. It, in most cases, is a matter of life or death. Catherine was listening to her body and I wasn't listening to her. That is something that I want every every parent to know. Just listen. Listen to your intuition and listen to your child because they know how they feel. Trust them.